As you can tell by the title of this video, Dinotopia, The Jurassic Awakening, is finally coming back. I apologize for the two-year hiatus. You know, I wanted to make this movie like two years ago when I was turning 16. But since I'm turning 18 this year, what better way to finally release this movie than July 27th? Now there are going to be some changes. For the exception, okay, the bloodliner is still the bad guys. That's the good news. But now we're adding Solo Sokoa. And uh, because Marvel Pony the movie is turning seven years old this October, we're adding Tempest Shadow to the movie as well. Because I love Emily Blunt. Her voice acting is great. And her character in this movie was actually pretty good. So we're adding her. Dean Ambrose in the movie was originally going to be a twist villain working for Roman Reigns. But since that isn't going to work anymore, since Tempest Shadow's now in the group, you know, doing her business, she, Dean is just going to be a character, an outcast. So we won't, you know, so it won't be confusing. Now you may have seen or may have not seen the old original scenes from the final battle. That's not going to be in the final. The final battle is going to be completely different. I don't want to spoil anything, but there are going to be a lot of emotional scenes. And the songs are going to be completely different. You know, because some of them were used in Make Your Mark and uh, the Mall Pony G5 show. And I want to branch out to have more movie related songs. Because I released a soundtrack on the Phoenix Studios channel. There was some Rick Ashley, Pokemon, the first movie and stuff. But I want to change it up a bit. So um, you might hear some songs that you've never heard of before. And that's okay. They're from the Lost Wave community. So um, expect K-Girls drive me to be in the soundtrack. So um, that's going to be something. But anyways. Yeah, Donatopia, The Jurassic Awakening. Oh, and one more thing. It's now under Legendary and Disney. Instead of Pixar, TriStar, and Walt Disney Pictures. Because Pixar is... Just did Inside Out 2, and I don't want to cause competition or something in the fan-made universe. And uh, TriStar is literally doing nothing at this point, and they're already doing a movie with Roman Reigns and Kiki Palmer and some other people. So uh, Legendary Pictures is the replacement for Pixar and TriStar because they did Godzilla x Kong, which was the greatest MonsterVerse movie franchise of all time. Their sequel was pretty good. I saw it in theaters. So yeah, that's all you have to know about Donatopia, The Jurassic Awakening. I'm going to find a way to get the voices onto AI. If I can't, then I'll just have to use clips from the show and stuff. So uh, anyways, I got to go. Before I leave this video, the trailer comes out June 30th while the movie comes out July 27th, the week before SummerSlam, for real this time. So um, please don't miss out on this high-definition quality feature film. And uh, uh, please subscribe for more information about Donatopia for real this time. And I apologize for the two-year wait. But trust me, the wait will be totally worth it after this. Good luck to you all. And that is official.